I don't see too many uh, like her. Today we are taking Eden to the audiologist for the first time. We've never had her hearing tested. We've never tried to figure out the cause of deafness or anything like that. I've looked in her ears a lot, so she does have a concept for that. So it presents sounds, okay. different frequencies, okay. um, then records the reflection back. Okay. It's just a measurement of outer hair cell function, okay. and it was a refer, which means that she didn't pass. Can we go in? You can just watch. Don't go in, Harry. No, don't go in. Let's let her. She's going to go in. All right, so you're hearing me, right? Yep. I'll be able to talk that way. I can, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, cool. Yeah, so I'm just going to do like bop, 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 and I'm going to turn it up and just let me know if you feel like she's responding in any way. Sure. Bop, 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 bop. Again. She's reacting to some of the sounds. She kind of seems like she's experiencing something. Um, yeah, she smiled. Right. And it, it happened on both sides when you went up to the maximum. Yeah. I'm not sure if she's experiencing a vibration coming through or if it's the sound itself. It's very possible it's the vibration. I'm at 100 decibels. Can you, like, immediately switch over to the right while she's still in this mindset? She's She keeps pointing at it with the same hand, so I just want to be sure. I think she might just be um, signaling that there's something on her head. <laughs> yeah, she's just signing headphones. Touching her ear and looking at her hand, like, what's happening? Yeah. Um, I think it was a vibrotactile response. Okay. I didn't really get anything through the headphones. That one first one was very questionable mm -hmm. when she pointed to that left right. ear. Right. So, so I know you were just kind of looking for some confirmation, right, to mm -hmm. have it done. Mm -hmm. um, definitely continue with sign. Are you all learning how to do that? Yeah, or we, were assigned, we were signing two years before she joined our family. So. Okay. Yes. And she's in school? We homeschool. Homeschool, perfect. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I would say she's got, she's deaf. Yeah. You know, she, profound. there's like profound. profound. There's really no measurable hearing. The vibro, vibro tactile responses were typing just the vibration. Mm -hmm. The two frequencies she responded to, we always get vibro tactile. I, when I got to the higher frequencies, she really didn't respond to those. So it's, it's nerve. I believe it's nerve. Okay. Uh, permanent hearing loss. That's pretty interesting. We were just researching that like 0.2% of the population is actually... Like, Profound deaf, deaf. Yeah. Like, 98.8% of people have some form of hearing. Yeah. Any idea why that happens? I mean, is there, is, is something, can you be profoundly deaf like that um, from having, like, meningitis, for example? I would say probably, mm -hmm. yes. Okay. There could have been something that she had, you know, as, as an infant even, you know, that could have destroyed that. Mm -hmm. I don't know that okay. there's any way to ever but, know. I don't see too many uh, like her with like no really no measurable hearing. Mm -hmm. yeah. So wow. as I'm talking to you, I'm like going through my mind like <laughs> maybe yeah. maybe we could do that because there there would be reason to, mm -hmm. um, to further investigate yeah. uh, if if we can find out what's going on or what. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So we can get that scheduled up front. So we have another appointment for her in a month where she's going to meet with like the next level up doctor because yeah. even though she's profoundly deaf. It, he can do more imaging scans and like look at bone structure and just different things that will give us more information. We just think that's good knowledge to have. And also for her someday, as she gets older, she's gonna wanna know. And so we're gonna come back and do that in a month. And something about
Contagious, you spread throughout me to end.